Hello everyone, hey thanks for stopping back today. Fred here. It is our first probably official winter storm. Uh, we're supposed to get uh, I believe three to five inches tonight and uh, yeah it's cold. <laughs> Spin you around here. Nice gentle snowfall right now but we are definitely uh, Supposed to get some tonight. Let's not hope. Let's hope not too much. Uh, I came out here to start the smoker. I've got a turkey tenderloin in there that I'm going to put in tonight. And I wanted to come out and fire this thing up and get it going. But the problem is, I know I'm low on pellets. <laughs> I am very low on pellets and there's actually some snow in there how in the world does snow get up underneath that I don't know <laughs> oh, did you hear that it did not like that at all wow that motor did not like that at all Well, we need to get some pellets, and I've got some in the back of the truck. And that was one of the reasons I wanted to come out here, is to go get a small bag of pellets I had. It was what was left when we were camping. The snow's about, uh, we've got about four inches down right now. I probably should have come out here and ran the snowblower. I did not. My neighbor did you can see he did across the street i'm usually out here before he is they did some snow blowing there but here you can tell eh, two inches or so well let's see if i can get this thing open which i did ran to uh get that salt last night i just wanted to get some weight back here because I have to travel to Sandusky, San, say that's why Sandusky, Ohio, tomorrow morning. My daughter has a theater uh, competition team she's on. They're practicing up there tomorrow. So we will be taking the truck up there tomorrow for sure, because I have four wheel drive. We'll get up there and get her to that event. So, come over here and get this fed here. These are the, yeah, these are those Bear Mountain Gourmet Blend. I do like this. These are some very good pellets. Let's, uh, stop here. Here we go. That motor definitely does not like that. I should have had the cover on it, but I did not. I took the cover off the other day when we had that windstorm come through here. And, uh, yeah, I should have definitely put that cover back on. We're getting all fired up here. Let's go throw this away. This bag is now empty. Well, I guess when I come back tomorrow, We'll be firing up the snow blower and getting all this off of here. Can definitely do that. I'm shooting this video with my new Osmo Action 4 that just came in the mail. 
I have officially had enough of the GoPro bugs. <laughs> Too much battery drain just from setting that <laughs> turned off. Not knowing if I'm going to get audio. I've had that issue for quite a while. And uh, it was just time to give a serious look at the Osmo Action again. I had the original Osmo Action. I really did like that camera. That camera I never had any problems with. So, it's kind of a no-brainer. This guy over here was being an idiot driving down the street. Tried to floor it and made an idiot of himself. <laughs> anyway, but yeah, this is the Osmo Action 4. We'll see how this video comes out. It's the first. All right, we're going to let this uh, get uh, going up to 350. Usually I put on 325, but with it being cold, I'm going to put 350 today. So we'll give this about 15 minutes to warm up, and we'll bring the turkey loin out. And we'll have some dinner. So uh, thanks for sticking by on this new test drive of the Action 4. And... My reload of the <laughs> pellet grill. So something to do today. And uh, another view of the beautiful snow coming down. On that note, see you on the next one.